Good evening, Valley, and thanks for joining CBS 4 News at 6. I'm Eddie Scott. And I'm Nicole Hickel in for Marcy Martinez. Happening right now, thousands of dollars in medical equipment and ambulances from La Jolla will soon be put up for sale after they were seized by the Precinct 3 Constable's Office. The ambulances and medical equipment may be auctioned to the highest bidder on Friday to pay a delinquent property tax bill. CBS 4's Patrick Shelvier is in La Jolla with the very latest. I'm standing outside of the La Jolla Fire Department where a pro-medic ambulance is currently stationed. However, just a few weeks ago, five of the company's ambulances were seized as a result of a tax warrant issued by the district court. And the item seized may hit the auction block on Friday. Precinct 3 Constable Larry Gallardo tells CBS 4 News that deputy constables seized the ambulances and medical equipment. The ambulances are set for auction Friday. The equipment will follow next week. ProMedic owes more than $100,000 in delinquent property taxes, according to Hidalgo County court records. The company owes taxes to the PSJA School District, the La Jolla School District, and Hidalgo County, among many others. We reached out to ProMedic and its lawyer for comment, but haven't heard back. Mike Alanis, the city manager of La Jolla, tells me that as far as he knows, ProMedic is up to date with their certifications and they're still servicing La Jolla. He went on to say that as far as a business standpoint, they've done a successful job in servicing the residents of La Jolla. In La Jolla, Patrick Shalvier, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.